All right. Vacation. Okay. Vacation. You can get injured in vacation. Why? <laughs> because you do it too much. Do like, like that. All chill right? out. And I asked you this question the other day. All right. What is vacation for you? But <laughs> it is a break from the norm. Do 100%. Nothing. 100% nothing. nothing. All right. Ain't no clock going off. All right, I'm gonna wake up whenever fuck I want to wake up yeah, that, like that. Freaking bro. we anything that we have planned, we get to it when we get to it. We get to even it. if like I ain't even planning nothing. Me, I'm not planning nothing. All the, right? There may be things in the location that I want to do. Yes, and like like yeah, I want to go to I'm the gonna aquarium. Do research, yeah, like I'm oh, gonna, I want to go do that. Yeah, 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 you know. But you know, am I gonna do it? Okay, on Tuesday I'm gonna do this. On Wednesday I'm gonna do this. Yeah, I ain't gonna be. There's no timetable for it. When I wake my ass up, I mosey down. Maybe I'm in a hotel. More likely it's gonna be Airbnb, whatever it is. But right, you know, get some breakfast. You know, like that. I tell my wife, hey, babe, I need to go get my energies. She knows that means you know, for her that means coffee. For me that means energy drink. Right. So I get, I, I gotta get my energy. In. <laughs> nice. I have my fucking my. <laughs> you know, like caffeine in the bloodstream, <laughs> right? Right, and then once I'm woke up and I and I'm ready for the day and shit like that, yeah, maybe that's you know eleven, twelve, one. Right now with a nine month, oh, it's not too much sleeping in anyway, right? But the thing is, is that I am not pressed for nothing. There's no rushing for nothing. All right. So the reason I say, all right, freaking going on vacation can get you injured. All right, is that you know the majority of people that go on vacation, you right? Know, what are they really doing I, right? before going on vacation? And then how many times are they going on vacation? How many how, like what do you, if you had to guess the, the average you know American goes on vacation? Oh, I, you know, bro, I wouldn't have any idea. Let, bro. Let, let, let's go uh, look. Cause, at I mean, because when you look at like um, when you look at um, like AAA talks about the people traveling. Like they talk about travel stats, but I'm wondering is travel stats like actual travel? Like when I travel to compete, it's not a vacation for me. Like I'm going like a, yeah, I, you're, like I do you're like doing yeah, like, yeah, yeah. You're there for a purpose. I, 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 vacation for me is like no events. I, like I'm talking about, <laughs> I'm not going like vacation ain't because I gotta go to a wedding or I right. gotta go to a family event or I like or I gotta go to a tournament. That's not vacation. Like you like I'm gonna enjoy myself. Yeah, I got a break from work and I'm gonna enjoy myself, handle business and then come back. Yeah, but I'm, right. vacation is like nah. Like we set out, you know, four or five maybe like at tops a, a week because. I mean, even a week's a long bro, time. That's a long that fucking is, time, bro. And I can like more than four days is too bro, much. Bro, I'm I, I yeah, lose I mean, my shit if I'm on. <laughs> what are you finding right now? Yeah, but like vacation for me is like not nah, like I have nothing to do. You know, I, what I mean, I like we've been we want to go to we we want to go to the beach. It's the summer, you know, like that. Let's go to the beach. All right, it's the winter. We want to take a, a snowboarding trip or something like that. Like we have no no rush at all for anything. It's purely on our time only to relax. Like the average American. Yeah, the, 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 I'm seeing 11, Take. basically 11 to 17 days off per year, but not how many number of how many times they go. How many times they go? If I would say at least twice, if I like, if I had to, like, you know, one in the summer, one in the winter, at least twice. Yeah, you know yeah. I mean? especially sense. you have a family like that, you can have to do the summer, you know, for the kids, get them, you know, freaking do something, you know, right? What I mean? Like that, and then you have a long. You have the, usually for the kids in the, in the winter, you the have winter, a good yeah, yeah. two weeks off of school. Or like a week and then like two, three days on and then another week off like that. So basically right. two weeks off and then you had to do something for the for the winter like that. So if I had to guess average, you know, American twice, twice a year. Yeah, two, three times, right. yeah. More than likely, sense. what are you doing? You're always working eight hours a day, sitting down on, in front of a computer and everything like that. All right. And then you're rarely active, you know what I mean? Like that. So you're going to tell Don't, me, bro. okay, Don't, it's bro. the summer, like that. So like I, the reason I bring this up is because like, <laughs> oh my all right. God. Like my I don't wife, it. yeah. Like the reason I bring this up, my wife, you know, she was working remote, sitting in a lot of phone calls and stuff. Now she's a little bit more in the field, visiting officers. But like she does a lot of driving, right? You know, and then like still, you're talking about 20, 30 minutes in the car driving one way, like that. That's a lot of just sedentary, you know, freaking uh, 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 <clears throat> days and stuff right. like that. You tell me you're gonna go on on a beach vacation and freaking uh, like so where we went we went to a Florida 
Okay. All right. It was very small little city uh, uh, outside of Destin and stuff like that. So we rented bikes for, for the three days that we're there. Okay. All right. You tell me you, 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 you've you never ridden bikes before like that, but now you're going to be riding bikes? <laughs> you know, her ass was hurting, bro. bro. Like that. Because, like, bro, if you've never been on a bike, you know, consistently like that, that bike seat will Even destroy Even if you almost consistently, bro, that seat yeah. is not made for bro, yeah. <laughs> that seat is you terrible, know, Let's take it in there. Like, let's, let's just take it even more, a little bit more extreme, man. You know, you you go on the hikes and stuff. How many times you help people go on the hikes and they roll their ankle or they just their legs are just killing? They can't Yo, even get out. Of I don't it. even understand hiking. Snowboarding, bro. you know, you go on a winter trip, you go snowboard, straight hospital. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm just, just, just saying, bro. Hey, have you ever you, you've never no, tried? No, bro. Would you ever try? No. Are you opposed to it? No, I, I'm not opposed to it, bro. But there's this thing bro. about like you're sliding on ice. This shit is slick fiberglass. <laughs> like there's no real break, bro. Like I, I've I, I did it one time. Probably one of the funnest vacations I've ever been on. To. Snowboard, snowboard, and it took me a very long time to go snowboard. You know, my 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 second oldest brother, him and his his friends, like our group of friends that we they uh I think they've been going on like seven eight years now of snowboarding trips consistently. Lalo? Yeah, Lalo. Yeah, really. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, Lalo's hips don't lie though. He looks like he can skateboard. Bro, the first <laughs> this first year my brother went, bro. All right, he came back. All right, because okay, so this was uh, he started like right around the time I, I, I tore my ACL. Okay, so that's why I didn't go with him and start with him. You know, what I mean? right? Like, fuck my my shit up. You know what I mean? And so and then you know I didn't get I didn't get Lalo. fucking I didn't get a surgery until 2016. So three years after, and then right. even after I got surgery, I just was not comfortable, bro. On um, like I was like nah. I just paid all this money. I, I ain't gonna go out and then fuck and then me up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, again, you know. What 100%. I mean? And like with snowboarding, your shit is locked in in there. You know what I mean? The boots are locked into the board, so it's very hard to bail. Like you really need to know how to bail if like if you eat it. You know what I mean? The things and, you're saying and, to me are all the reasons yeah, why I'm and, not doing it. When you ski, yeah, the the uh, uh, the the skis break off, so you don't fall with the skis on. You see what I mean? So like that. But uh, okay. with skiing, it's a lot harder. Uh, uh, to uh, to like figure like master it. Snowboarding is a little is easier. Like it's harder in the beginning, but it's easier in in the long run. You. As for skiing, it's easier in the beginning, but it's harder in the long run to master it. Especially okay. when you start going in blacks, double blacks, meaning like how steep that fucking I'm mountain is, that. like that. So all right, so my brother did it, bro. First year he did it, he came back. You know, I picked him up from the airport, bro. Huge ass black eye. <laughs> Like legit, like For he, what? like okay, my brother's real ambitious, all right, right, like that, okay, and so you know he really bit off way more than can he chew, like that, and like I think he was going on a real high level blue or something like that, because right. it goes from like bunnies, greens, blues, like like somewhere in between blues and blacks, then blacks, and then double blacks is like like you like you, you pro, yeah, you know what I mean, like you doing it every day, What's and, doing? Sean Green, huh? Uh, Sean White. Sean White. Sean White. Yeah. Yeah. Beats. Yeah. Beats. So, brother got a little ambitious, started going real fast downhill. Bro, freaking flip, hit his head. He was legit knocked out. His, like, the, my, the his other friends, like, they didn't know where he was in, in like, at all. Like, because he went so far in front, you know, of them that he lost him and then he was knocked out. So like they, that. so it's not like, oh, yeah. there's Lalo right there. Yeah. Like, no, no. They don't know where he went. Yeah. They didn't see that he, they were uh. nowhere inside. Bro wakes up, makes it down to the head, and they're like, bro, what happened to me? He was like, yeah, I got knocked out, bro, black eye. <laughs> oh, my God. All right. But, like, shit like that, you know what I mean? Bro, like, you know, scary, so, bro. like, that, that, that's how dangerous vacations can be, bro. Like that. But I ain't, ain't going to lie. I did it, bro. And, man, you like, you think, you like, you you take a lot of shots, right? Or right, how, right. Like, you know, you, right. you know if you, let, let's say, let's say you're real aggressive with your wrestling, all right, in 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 uh, in, in a, in a, a training session and stuff. How how burnt out are your your Legs. thighs? Ridiculous, bro. All right, snowboarding times ten. <laughs> Bro, like I thought my legs were good. You know what I mean? I work out, I squat, you right. know what I mean? I, I do yeah, I take the shots in classes and stuff like that. You know, I like I'm I'm good. Bro, like the whole time you just imagine just like, you know, a wall sitting, that, that position in a wall sit, just like for hours, bro. Because that's how you have to sit. That's how you have like to that. sit. You have to sit in there and you're flexing back and forth on the board. Bro, I was like, So so you know what that kind of reminds me of? What? So so a lot of people would never think that I, that I did this, right? But I used to do this a long time ago. Uh, windsurf. 
<laughs> <When surfing. laughs> right? And you talking about snowboarding, <laughs> dog? Come on, bro. Dog. It's water, but yeah, it's hey, different. Hey, really, water? <laughs> Bro. Because uh, because black people are known <laughs> to be good in water, <laughs> all right? You know what we call them in the military? What Iron that? ducks, all right? <laughs> Bro, <laughs> so, all right. Uh, every so year. To, but <laughs> <laughs> and you talking about freaking snowboarding. Bro, you know what, I, so what scares me about with snowboarding and skiing is all the people that hit trees and die. Like that's well, crazy. Okay, but hey, so that's why there's levels, bro. Just okay, you could just stay on the greens if you want to have a good time and just so, not test yourself. Bro, Blues I, I, max, bro. I ain't gonna lie. All right, it's like the first, like the all right, like, all right, the first day that uh, the first trip we were on a four day trip. So right. So first day, you know, get into the Airbnb, setting up. Second day, we it was actually our first day actually snowboarding. Right. So we start super early. You want to start super early and stuff like that. Try to because it just takes a, a, a the line is very long for the lift to get you all the way to the mountain and stuff like that and you know you just want to try to get as many runs as you can especially you know how high you go up it'll, it'll take you a good you know 20 30 minutes how, oh, depending just to like get that to the top. To, not to get to the top i'm talking you, you you get to the top but it takes about 20 30 minutes to get down uh -huh. so you're talking about okay another 10 like five 10 minute rise back up you know what i mean like right. that so it takes a lot of time you know what i mean so you probably do two runs in the morning get some lunch another two or three maybe at night you know in the evening before the nightfall bro you know I got real ambitious, bro. All right, the first day I did a, uh, like a four-hour class, like two hours in the morning, uh, lunch, and then two hours in that, and then like just to get a hang of it, it was real quick, you know what I mean? So I can like, and then before I knew it, my I, my brother took me on 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 a blue the first day. You know? <laughs> I'm Let's like, I, I, yeah, I skipped bunnies and greens. I went straight with him. Cause I want to chill with him. Like I'm athletic and I've written a skateboard before too right. and stuff like that. So I was able to hang with him, but like, I was a lot of falling, bro. My eyes was killing me the next day. Cause I felt so much like that. Like, that's why you love when it's like, um, like good, fresh snow days. You know what I mean? I, I, I can't powder. think powder. There you go. Yeah, yeah. When it's a powdery day. <laughs> uh, you, you nerd, yeah. bro, so it's a, it's a, it's a, <laughs> it's a powdery day like that, right. so that it really reduces the fall. You know, you really hurt like that. If it's not, you know what I mean, like, bro, you just hit it solid ice all the time. So, that shit will kill okay, you. Okay, okay, okay. All right, I'm with you. So then the next day, I was like, all right, I'm cool with the blues. And then I found my brother. We went on a little high, like in between the blue blacks like that, bro. A big ass storm came in, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Like that, like we try to beat it down. About we try to beat the beat the storm downhill before it got here, and we got caught in the middle. I ain't gonna lie, bro. I was scared, dog. <laughs> I, was just, I was like, yo, because you like you like this, you can't even see your hands. Oh no! Nah, like that, I was like, I was like, oh my god! I was like, man, for the second day, I'm about to die. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but that's what like Tell so about this wind selling. <laughs> so so no, bro, bro, wind surfing is wind like surfing. you don't like you don't like you don't really think about it, but much like like you were just saying. <laughs> Like it's the squat position. Like you're mm -hmm. in a position, but like when you windsurf, you're also so the sail is up and it's got so it's a big it's a big sail and it's got like rods in it to help keep the sail bowed out. Yeah. Right. So but what you have to do is there's a bar across that you're yeah, holding you're kinda like, and you have and mm -hmm. you have to manipulate it to catch the wind. Mm -hmm. But when you catch that wind, bro, like 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 you have to control that. So you're working your upper body, yeah. you're like in the squat position and then you're trying to go over the wave. So a lot of fun, but but at the end of it, bro, Oh man! Like bro. everything fucking hurts, bro. Uh, you know, you, everything. You, you hurts. see the you see those motherfuckers that you know hit the hit the fucking wave and then they go in the air and shit. Stop. <laughs> those dudes are too, they're way you too. You know, much. They, they, and then like I've seen videos of like motherfuckers like trying to catch the wind and the and the wave right, and then they try to clear the fucking pier or something like that. I'm like, bro, why? I, why? I mean, <laughs> this, sometimes the shit's extreme. And then, like you were talking about falling on the ice. So here's another thing, right? Uh -huh. You're going to laugh at this, too. <laughs> right? But I ice skate. <laughs> oh, oh, my God. This dude turned into Elsa. Oh my <laughs> bro, <head>. bro. <laughs> it, I mean, it, and it, you know, I, I use ice skate. But ice skating, is, ice skating is fun. I bet you went to the roller rings a lot. <laughs> <laughs> like ATL? Just <laughs> 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 like so, this. bro, but so, but, but you want to talk about hard, bro? Yeah, that because because rollerblading, so roller skating, like that, bro. You roller skate? Uh, uh, yeah. So roller skating on four wheels is kind of cool. So, but when you put that blade in the middle, like your mm -hmm. balance is different, mm -hmm. bro. Yeah. So remember we were talking about um, 
um, Asian squats and how people think it's their hip mobility and it's their ankle. No, ankle it's, mobility. It's their ankle it's mobility. So, it's it's either, it's in, no, it's not their knees. It's, it's either, you know, depending on where it is, it's either going to be in their hips or they're going to be the ankles. So, so mm -hmm. you're, if you ice skate yeah. or rollerblade, you feel it in your ankles, bro. Yeah. Like, cause just trying to keep that balance on that wheel. But it's yeah. still a lot of fun, bro. It's in high school. Uh, Only black guy on ice. In high school, I... Uh, uh, the the group of friends I work out with, like they, they uh, for like a, a brief stint, bro, like a little phase, uh, I started getting into like aggressive inline, like oh, that. Yeah, so yeah. I'm doing like you know, um, what's that cro no, X X game shit? You yeah, know yeah, what yeah. I mean? like that, and yeah, shit. grinding and stuff, bro. And so like I was getting into it, you know. What I mean, uh, I wasn't, you know, I tried the the skateboard stuff, but I was like, nah. A, I like my shoes. I don't want to fuck my shoes up. You know right. what I mean? Like that, cause, you know. And then I like, you know, just doing the whole, uh, <clears throat> the whole ollie stuff. Like I just, <laughs> I just, I, yeah, I couldn't, yeah. I couldn't really, get, you know, get the hang of that. But I was like, all right, but I'm athletic enough. I know I can jump and you know, and then grind with the with the inline skates. You know, what I mean? right? Like that, bro. And then I remember one time we went, we went out in uh, in the, like downtown area and stuff, and started you know looking for places, bro. And like, so I try to gap. Uh, I tried to uh, like gap this like staircase. It was probably like ten or twelve stairs like that, but grind down like that. Shit, bro! I completely missed it. Caught my right in the nuts, bro. I was <laughs> like, at the day, I was like, nah, I'm good. You know, like that. <laughs> that's enough pain for me, bro. Cause like like at the time, man, that's when I was watching a lot of like freaking uh, those mixtapes with uh, with skateboarding and stuff oh, like that. Yeah. I don't know if you ever yeah, caught yeah. a hold of any of those mixtapes and stuff like that, <laughs> bro. You know, and I was watching so and like this motherfuckers is like. Bro, I, like I don't know how they just keep falling and then get right back up and then y'all like, nah, I'm cool. You know what I mean? I so, <laughs> so <clears throat> I'm a little bit older than you. Right? Uh -huh. So, g going back, bro, my favorite movies growing up, Rad. Yeah, I remember. Gleaming that. the cube, bro. I'm all about a bike with some pegs on it, <laughs> bro. bro <laughs> yeah. Like, and so it's just like, like I, like I've always loved like the, and that's how I got into some of the, some of the stuff that I did. But what ended up <laughs> happening was, because I'm black. As I got older, it was less cool to be skateboarding and BMXing, mm -hmm. and more cool to play football. Football. <laughs> so you stop doing that stuff, yeah. and then you start playing football, and then like you either you leave your BMX and all Bro, this stuff. Uh, freaking uh, since you rad, uh, like did, did you have a mongoose or anything? Like yeah, that? absolutely. Yeah, fuck yeah, I still bro. got one I, at the to house to this day, bro. I don't remember. Right, I, <laughs> I had this one. I always like for the longest time. I was like, it was this blue one. All nice. right, it was a blue one, black handlebars, black pegs. You know, the thing was nice, bro. <laughs> like that, but it was only one gear. All right, right. I, freaking, uh, I remember. Uh, I wanted to say this was my sophomore uh, a year, sophomore junior year, like that winter break. All right. And, uh, you know, so that whole two weeks that, uh, that we were on winter break and stuff, I would ride. It was a good like hour ride to to school to go to, to practice like that. Nice. I didn't even have to be at practice. Right. You know what I mean? Because I didn't I didn't make uh, I didn't make conference like that. Uh, I didn't win the conference and I didn't make regionals. I wasn't going to go to state. But I knew I was like I wanted to get better and I wanted to be there for my teammates and stuff like that. So I would just every like every day I would just ride out there and just be an extra body for them. You know, like that, you know, and, and on a fucking um, uh, one gear bike because like we would have uh, I would have heels, bro. bro. It was the worst, bro. But, but you know, when I think about it now, because it's not called rigid, but on those on those single like single speed bikes, mm -hmm. like now, bro, you want to talk about a real workout for your legs, bro? Yeah, get on one now. Yeah, bro, oh, like, on God. the vacation, bro. So riding the bikes, all right, freaking. Uh, uh, we we had two bikes, and then my bike had uh, the little attachment for for Mateo to be uh, chilling in the back, the little baby carriage thing, right? Like that. But like on the seat, or was it like no, the, no, no? Like, it was like that whole. Trailer. It was the whole little trailer, okay, set, okay, okay, you okay, know, okay. like that. You know, and there's there's one hill like that. My wife. <laughs> She gonna kill me bro. Like that. And like I was just cruising I was like babe You don't even got Mattel on the back You better hurry the hell up You know what I mean Bro we All right. Yeah. And then you know Let's go back to what you said It wasn't cool to be black And freaking skateboarding and stuff bro uh, Alright So I had this one dude On our team wrestling dude Black guy Right Alright his name was Smiley all right, like that freaking never smile. No, that's why he was his name was smiling because he was always smiling. Oh, really? Okay, like that bro. I'm not you talk about 
just strong as fuck, bro. And his legs, man, like like he probably had the most built legs if freaking on our team for a high schooler. And, and I believe he was a, a, a freshman at the time or a, junior, right. or, or a sophomore like that. He was he was two grades below me. So, OK, I was a junior. So, yeah, he was a freshman. Wow, right? OK, like that. Bro, like pure strength, like dude, dude, so athletic, man. Cause he rode his his he he freaking rode his skateboard everywhere, everywhere. Mm. you went. You know what I mean? Everywhere he went, home, school, anywhere you ever saw him, bro. You see him like uh, like uh, where I where I went where I went to high school and stuff. We didn't have like you know eight lane highways like this like that. Right. Our high lanes, our high lanes was literally two two uh, two street highways. With <laughs> right, That's right, you know, like right. the country, you know, kind of uh, road. Like you would just see him just scoring. <laughs> Kick push, like baby. Yeah, kick pushing it, bro. Like that. <laughs> Everywhere he went, bro, his legs were like, bro, try bro, to take him down. Fuck, bro, when, no, not a thinking day. about back then when we used to <clears throat> ride bikes all the time and all the summer and like think about the shape that you had to be in. Mm -hmm. Because what did you do when you got off your bike? You immediately started running. Yeah. <laughs> you immediately started running. You I'm put like, the bike down and started bro, running. I rode an hour to practice, did a three hour practice, and then an hour back. <laughs> you know what I mean? And then got home like and that. ran in the yard. Like, you know, like, like you're no, always I'm, running. Bro, I'll just chill the rest of the day, man. Bro. Straight gaming it the whole time, you know. Like we that. were just we were just we were just always running back then and it was it was fun, man. It was it mm -hmm. was you do all kind of stuff and all kind of X games was just kicking in, so you were Travis Pre Travis Pastrana, Pastrana bro. Yeah. Tony Hawk, like all you're looking them, at yeah. all these guys and you're like, Damir, yeah, uh, yeah, you're, on the yeah. bike, bro. bro you're yeah. like, you're like, all I can do that. Yeah, <laughs> fuck all, me, all I need is a half pipe. Hell, dude, you can't do that <laughs> shit. Man. Yeah, bro, them dudes is just man. I, I was, I, man, I actually watched um, something with um, Pastrana and how like how he would how he would like train. Mm -hmm. And he's got a big foam pit in the yard. Oh, yeah, yeah, so yeah. So you just jump off, and then you just land yeah. in this big-ass pit of foam. Well, plus, on top of that, he don't want to be doing them stunts, you know, freaking in real time, and then fuck up all his bikes he has. It, yeah, it, so it's better for it, that bike just it, land in the foam just pit. Just land in the foam, <laughs> yeah. and you go. That, that, But that, you know, like, okay, he don't do a lot of uh, freaking motocross stuff no more, but, like, that dude is super serious into his um, uh, rally car racing. Yeah, I was going to say, he, he's, like he's rally car now, yeah. You know, he, 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 he like... He be doing like all these stunts, like uh, grinds and slides and shit like that, because he he has a specially built fucking, uh, I want to say like a Ford freaking Focus. If it's probably a Ford Focus, yeah, <laughs> something like that, yeah. <laughs> then, bro, bro, yeah. Sp speaking of special built cars, so this is this is crazy. It's way <clears throat> off topic, but a couple of years ago I went. It was not off topic. It's because a couple of years ago I was getting ready, probably been fifteen or sixteen, no, sixteen or seventeen. I was when I was getting ready to train. I went out of town. I went to Macon, Georgia. Right now, if anybody know, doesn't know where Macon, Georgia is, all I can tell you is it's in Georgia, but it's a little small town. It's in Georgia, east, north, south, west, where maybe in the center. Like, I, I don't really center, know. It's like, just like, in Georgia. Uh -huh. It is a tiny, it's a tiny town. Yeah, Atlanta, so. like, what's the next, like, major? <clears throat> you know? I think it's in between, I think it's south of Atlanta, but I could be wrong. Mm -hmm. Let right, me look I, it up. I, I'll look so, it up. I'll go ahead. Keep so, going. so, yeah. uh, so I go to Macon, Georgia, and I'm there. And at the time I was training, so I, so I had to be there for two weeks for work. So I was like, oh, let me find a place to train, mm -hmm. right? So I go and I'm looking and I find this place, only place there is a place called Rush MMA, right? In Macon, Georgia. Mm -hmm. So I hit him up and the guy that owns it is this dude named Bubby Mitchell, right? So I talked to Bub and he was like, yeah, he was like, yeah, don't worry about it, come, out, come by. I said, I'll be here two weeks, you know, you know, do, how do I pay the membership? And he was like, look, come in. You know, train with us. We'll do whatever. We'll chill, um, and then we'll talk. You know, we'll talk about it when you get here. Mm -hmm. So, I get to Rush. I go there. It's a big facility, bro. It's kind of like, it's like it's like yours, mm -hmm. right? It's a big facility. He's got um, he's got weights in one place. He's got a big mat for for jujitsu, and then he's got a couple of cages in it, right? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> and so you got to know, you got to see Bubby first. You got to see Bubby. Bubby's like the tallest midget you'll ever see. <laughs> Dude's like five one, five two, right? But he's a wrestler. Savage, dude. Savage. It looks um, like it's about, I would say, give or take an hour or so uh, southeast of uh, Atlanta. That's, that, that sounds about right. <clears throat> yeah. But it's, you see, it's a tiny town. It's in the yeah, middle of nowhere. Yeah, it is. Mm -hmm. And so I get there, and I'm there, and I'm chilling at, at Rush MMA, and I'm training with these guys. And, bro, these dudes are super cool, right? Mm -hmm. Like, they're super cool. Um, Quentin, Steve, um, just a whole just a whole cool crew guy. So then when it's time for me to leave, I'm like, hey, bub, I need to settle up. Yeah. Right. And it's like, nah, don't worry about it. 
He's like, you came through, you trained with my guys, everybody trained good, everybody liked you, no meathead bullshit, you know, nothing. So he's yeah. like, don't worry about it. So I was like, damn, okay, cool. Um, so if you're ever in Macon, Georgia, I don't know why you'd be in Macon, if you're ever in Macon, Georgia, Russia MMA is a good place to stop. <laughs> now, how does it have to do with cars? So I still talk to Bub every now and again. Yeah. So Bubby has a Musta- uh, Mustang that he races on the drag strip. That he just car that, bro is doing wheelies in a Mustang with a parachute on it, bro. Oh, and I'm like, what are stuff, you like, doing, bro? That's why really bars were invented, bro. Bro, yeah. this thing is crazy. Yeah. And I'm just like, I'm like, man, are you kidding me? Talk to him today. Dude's like, dude, like, dude is getting sponsored by national brands now. Hey, bro, you know, uh, I like to go fast, but not that fast. <laughs> bro, <laughs> <laughs> bro, can you imagine being, yeah. a, you're talking about a quarter mile. <laughs> this dude has to, his Mustang has to be eights, sevens in yeah. a quarter mile. What? Uh, yeah, no. I, I, I like to go that fast, but all four wheels stay on the ground. <laughs> no, 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 I don't want. If I'm going that fast, I want to be in an airplane. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Wrap it all up. All right. Hey, <laughs> vacation could be dangerous. All right, especially you doing wheelies in your Mustang. All <laughs> for right? sure. <laughs> you for like that, that? that for sure. All right, I man. Honestly, man. Hey, I think if anybody knows that they're gonna go on a vacation, they're gonna be planning hikes and, and bike rides and snowboarding and 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 windsurfing and stuff like that. Hey, like, honestly, I think they need to have mindsets. Like, hey, I got to kind of get in the gym and work out for I gotta, these things. I got to do a you little something. You know what I mean? Like that. I got to do a little something. Yeah. Or at least, you know, make sure you, like, uh, uh, spend a whole day or so in a, in a class to get reacquainted with these shits you, before do, you just go back into it. When you know? do people work out before they go on vacation? <laughs> Never. Bro. <laughs> like, who's when, working out and training bro, to go on vacation? When they're going to go to the beach and sit out and do nothing, and they just want to yeah. look good in a bathing suit? Uh, of, of course, yeah. yeah. You have <laughs> a point. Yeah. Like, like, okay, point. I'm, I'm going to go do this. Yeah. But it's like, but when you're going to do an active vacation, it's like, yeah. fuck it, let's just go. Yeah, let's just go. It's all spur of the moment and <laughs> shit like that. Before they know they're pulling hammies or breaking arms and like that. And guess what? Now they they forced to sit the rest of the three days on their ass because they got a broken Bro, foot or something. Before, <laughs> before we'll get into the real topic. True story. A friend of mine mm-hmm. went skiing, bro. Yeah. Tore her ACL. Did she plan to go skiing? Plan to go skiing. Uh huh. Didn't tear her ACL skiing. Tore her ACL on like like walking or something. Like fell walking. Yeah. Into, I was like, the- <laughs> I'm like stop. Bro, it happens all the time, man. All right, oh, you shit, take a vacation, bro. guys. Just hey, you know, don't don't bite off more than you can chew. All right, plan. you know, I, don't yeah. plan. Break fall. You know, yeah, you know, just. <laughs> Make sure that you know you stay in your lane. You know what I mean. <laughs> just stay in your lane. You know you know like that. Yeah, just stay in your lane. Stay in your lane. You know, like that. You know, know you're wrong. You know you can never go wrong with doing absolutely nothing <laughs> on just vacation. Gamble, that's what it, eat. Yeah. Put on ten pounds yeah. of vacation. You know, I don't know about that one. <laughs> Bro, I'm gonna eat <laughs> like that. I mean, like that. All 